So as you can see by the title today, I am reacting to status quo, rollover, lay down live from the end of the road tour that they were doing in 1984. Man, what an amazing start. It starts off with that epic grooving riff. You had that little melodic uh, lead guitar line that is absolutely amazing. I love how you got the uh, the three the three guys there just de jamming about, bobbing the reds. Such an amazing visual that the crowd as well going all the way up, man. It's got that signature status quo groove. The riffs are obviously fairly simple, which is like their signature thing, man. But nonetheless, it's really catchy. The words get stuck in your head and you just can't help but not sing along. Both their voices just work so well together as always, man. And if you are enjoying this reaction video and you want to see more, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell. Follow me on my social medias if you want. So the link in the description will take you to the original video. And also comment, man. What do you think about this band, this song? Let's be honest, man, you can't open up Bob your head, stamp your foot because it is really grooving. The uh, Fender sound is absolutely amazing. You know, they get that heavy groove to it and you just can't open up Bob your head, stamp your foot. The bass, the drums, the guitar working together to create this epic, unique signature status quo sound. And you've also got the keyboards as well that adds the little extra melodic layer onto it. And it's such a great thing to see. I'm glad we're reacting to this kind of like old school uh, footage of the band. The crowd are so loud, man, in the mix. You can hear them clapping, you can hear them singing when they are uh, singing. And uh, you've got this little part where it's like you just got the riff repeated, but you've got the lead uh, section that just keeps repeating and it is amazing, man. Melodic, nice. The tone of his guitar is amazing. Every note is sustained perfectly. And fortunate to have seen States Quo live before. Um, but man, it, I wish it was in this time frame, you know, back in the, uh, the old school vibes for sure. It would have been great. Man, you won't see it because I've had to edit it out, but I've just accidentally pressed my outro. But nonetheless, we've got that amazing solo that is happening right there. It plays with so much passion, feel. Every note is just like screaming, which is absolutely amazing. You had the crowd that was literally going all the way, Batman. And they are giving it the raw. Uh, they give it 110% on stage. And um, this is no different, man. They give it, It's an amazing visual of the, uh, the lights behind him as well. Wow.
the mix of everything is great the production on this is fantastic as well and even the video is great um let's be honest the fact that the solo just keeps on going and going it gets insane you can't have not bob your head stamp your foot and uh, let me know in the comment section have you was you at this gig did you see them in like the old uh, the old original lineup i'll be uh, interested to hear what your experiences were what they played um you can rub it in Wow, absolutely beautiful as it slowed right down there. You have the beautiful, clean guitar playing that just sounds beautiful. You've got the crowd as well chanting as well in the background. They are super loud. Such an amazing change in the tempo. Um, I'm interested to hear whether it's going to go back into it or whether it's going to stay on this kind of chill kind of vibe to uh, end the song, man. But uh, what a band, what a song, what a video as well. Man, it is uh, getting heavy now. The riff is working its way back in. The crowd are going absolutely nuts. They're already jumping about, which is absolutely amazing. The stage set is killer as well. It's massive. The crowd go all the way back. You've got the epic lights. You've got all the amps behind them as well. It is absolutely amazing. And um, let's just say this now. Rest in peace to the legend, man. He is uh, an amazing rhythm guitar player and deserves all the praise in the world. Just like that, it comes out of that epic slow section that was happening. It was picking the pace back up into this main riff and it goes back into the catchy chorus where you just can't help but not sing along. His voice is absolutely amazing as well. He has such a unique raspiness to it, but he can sing high, he can sing low as well. And it really does fit the style of the, of the band, the song really well as everyone's uh, singing along as well. If someone wants to correct me if I'm wrong, I was, I'm sure I've seen loads of interviews where he was like saying that he didn't fancy himself as a lead guitar player. But you know, when you watch some of these like uh, the older gigs, you know, it's, uh, where like the playing all these songs and he's doing like epic long solos, it just shows how talented he is and uh, he deserves all the praise in the world because each note is like it's singing a along with the song really well. And man, there's just so many people there, but obviously it was the farewell concert back in the day.
Well, if you did enjoy this video and you want to see more, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell, follow me on my socials if you want to. But that was indeed status quo. Roll over, lay down live at the end of the road tour. What an amazing show. What an amazing performance of a great song, man. Catchy, the words got stuck in your head. The crowd were going absolutely nuts. If you would, leave a like rating as well. Comment, what do you think about this band, this song? I want your opinions. I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye.